Good evening to you. This is your man on the Rachel's page, aka the uh, Emperor of Female Bodybuilding, coming to you live, live on YouTube. Anyway, it's been kind of a little quiet on the front of um, bodybuilding, not much going on. Uh, it's been a month since the Olympia, and right now a lot of competitors are getting ready for the 2021 season. Prepping, getting ready, dieting, you know. It'll probably be maybe about a month or so before you ever see any shows start up. But anyway, I was thinking about uh, these two ladies that's been in the sports for quite some time. That is Hella Trevino and Margie V. Martin. Now, these ladies have been competitors for quite some time. Man, their career started mostly in the 2000s, as you know. And um, it, either way, even though their backgrounds are different, they're, they're kind of similar in, in certain ways. Now, Hella is originally from Denmark, where she grew up. And she had a competitive um, background. And, you know, Margie is a former United States Marine. And she is a mother and, uh, you know, of two, of two children. Yeah. And Hella has been in the game for quite some time. You remember back in, in the around about to the early 2000s, she had an injury, was set out for a good while. But she did make a return around about um, 2011. And Margie... She's been doing pretty good, you know, and has an amazing career and just just, you know, one of the top competitors in the game right now. Even for the short time she's been in this in the sport, she has been a trailblazer. But most of these ladies, like I said, have similar pretty much similar backgrounds. They competed in about the same competitions against the same competitors. You know. As you know, uh, I said again, back in two two thousand three, um Hella competed at the Olympia, which was her first Olympia. And in 2014, Margie competed in her first Olympia, which was the last Olympia, you know, before the return of Miss Olympia in 2020. Margie is a two-time um, Verizon Phoenix World Champion, where she um, won the title, the title back in 2015 and 2016. And Hella is a two-time Verizon Phoenix World Champion, winning the title in 2017 and 2019. But like I said, these are women are just impressive. You know, if you look at them, just like Marjorie just has this impressive body. I mean, look at her. I mean, her arms, her quads. That's a big, a big seller is her quads. Her legs are just amazing. I think she has the biggest quads right now. Any woman in a first and um, competitive bodybuilding. And uh, Helena, you know, Hela, she, her Hela is just her body is amazing. Just muscle on top of muscle. I mean. It's unbelievable. It's undeni undeniably why she has been, you know, doing so well for such a long time in the sport. Margie just, I mean, look at her, you know, look at her shoulders, look at her, her lats. Just, it's like a wingspan, like she can get a fly. And Hella, just look at the triceps. You know, just amazing muscle, just beautiful, just quality muscle. You know, and Hella's and um, Margie's back. I mean, it's the you know, it looks like a billboard. I mean, wow, <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. you know, and Hella, she got a back on her too. I mean, you, you know, it's like a wall, you could probably climb it. Just great development on um, Hella, great, you know, you know, abs and you know, thigh shot. And even though that, you know, some say that um, Margie's abdominals not as, as strong because she has a Shoulder torso is still great, amazing. But like I said, these ladies are a talent in the in the sport. And maybe next like in in twenty twenty one, maybe things get a little better. And like I said, they have been stepping up for a long time, coming in, you know, doing you know sometimes winning most of the top levels, being making this year and last year's at, um, Olympia making the top three. And maybe it might be different, you know. But they're both beautiful ladies. In their own rights, and deserve to be, you know, honored and, and to revere. Just amazing talent, and just wonderful. I mean, I'm a big fan of both of them. I follow them both on social media. But like I said, the thing is that what should happen is that they need more, you know, sponsorship. They need to get more attention. One thing this will probably help to make female bodybuilding more mainstream. You know, and these two ladies would be great representatives of that. You know. Like I said, I'm a big fan of theirs, and I like to pay them a lot of respect. Maybe someday I might even get a chance to do an interview with them. Cross my fingers. But anyway, it's your man, All the Rage, George Page, a.k.a.
the Emperor of Fear and Bodybuilding. Like, don't like, don't subscribe. I'm out.